everybody assalamu alaikum welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for joining me again today i'm going to be showing you my simple lip routine so let's do this so first off i do start with clean lips no lipstick or anything like that and i'll go straight into using my barry m lip scrub this is peppermint flavored i do like the minty feeling you get at the end and I'd highly recommend the Barry M lip scrub because um, it's not harsh on the lips so after a lip scrubbing session your lips are not feeling dry or anything like that. It does have a few oils in the ingredients and the entire texture is quite soft so I really really recommend it. So you place enough lip scrub and you just sort of go in a few circular motions or motions around your lips until you feel like you've got it all out. The good thing about this is because of the fact that it's not really a harsh sort of scrub, it's very soft, a texture. You could scrub for for like two minutes, like I think I go a minute and a half, but you don't have to worry about it sort of being too harsh or cutting your lips or anything like that, which can happen with some lip scrubs. This is really soft and I just place my hand at the bottom to get any sort of scrub that's sort of falling off, get it and then place it back on my lips and keep scrubbing. So after like a minute I'm done scrubbing, take it off. You will feel a difference immediately, like your lips will feel softer. The good thing about lip exfoliation, it does make your lips feel sort of soft and healthy. If you had any sort of dead skin, it gets off. So the next step is I will be using a hydrogel lip mask and the one I have is from Rivage UK. This pack does come with five hydrogel lip masks which is quite enough and I'll be placing one on my lips and leaving it on for 10 to 15 minutes. Lip masks are really good for sort of softening and exfoliating your lips. They do help with dealing with sort of hyperpigmentation as well. And this is infused with collagen and rose water, which will nourish the lips. The main thing is not to take away sort of all the moisture from your lips, but to make sure you're putting it back in, not just sort of drying them up. Okay, so it does feel really cool on the lips, really cold as well. And like you can see from the instructions at the back, we have a few illustrations. Place it on, leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes and then take it off basically. So I'll see you guys in a few minutes. So when taking it off, you just sort of remove it like that. And as you can see, my lips do look quite nourished and moisturized and you can massage any of the remaining sort of product in and around your lips. So since it is night time I will be using this overnight lip mask. It really helps with hydration with your lips like moisturizing so they're not feeling dry and chapped. I really love this. I just place like a bit onto my lips and go to bed. So if it was daytime, I would be putting a simple sort of Vaseline um, or a lip gloss to keep it moisturized throughout the day. Of course, the best thing to do is take a lot of water, keep hydrated from the inside. But this is just to show you what I do to my lips on the outside. But that's my simple lip routine. Thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time. Love. BB